wacha ni wa challenge nyote mmezungumza lugha ya Kiingereza wacha twende lugha ya Kiswahili <laughs> Bwana Yesu asifiwe kwa majina naitwa Madelina Mkirema um, langu na fikiria hapa ni kuwashukuru tu nyote uh, St Paul uh, kama familia ya mtakatifu Paulo unajua ku translate hizi zingine ni nomu. <laughs> eh, ni kuwashukuru kwa njia ya kipekee because the journey wow I remember I got poached for me it was uh, I am a radio presenter by profession so nilipata kazi huku nakuru na ikawa anajiuliza maswali itakuwaje eh, katika mji huu mpya wa nakuru eh, na sikuwa nimefanya degree yangu and uh, I was like university ni nyingi but I just told God you know eh, Mungu nitayarishie naenda pahali pageni sijui ni university gani nitakayochagua but I have my own dreams unajua ndoto zangu ambazo nataka kuwafikia na nilipokuja hapa cha kushangaza ni kwamba mahala ambapo nafanya kazi ni karibu na hapa. And so katika ile hali ya kwenda kazini nikaona St Paul's University and I was like I was with my mom. I was like mom you remember nilikwambia I have a dream and I want to achieve it. I want to do my education and all that. And uh, I think God is telling us something. Tumepitia hapa sio eti tulikuwa tunajua kuna St Paul's University here but God makes a ways in various ways ambayo sisi binadamu hatuwezi kuelewa but again ukifikiria tena uh, you are like uh, God had a re- reason why ametupitisha katika barabara hii and so the journey started even though financial stability uh, ilikuwa tatizo kidogo maswali ya kihela eh, na nakumbuka kuna wakati mpaka nimelipa ndio semester lakini hiyo semester nyingine I'm worried namuuliza mama itakuwaje nauliza baba itakuwaje eh naendea walimu wetu uh, Mr. Gesimba by that time na nikamuuliza unajua nimelipa semester hii but next semester sijui kama nitatoboa ama itakuwaje uh, Mr. George here has been so uh, supportive uh, maana pia nilikuwa namuendea nikimuuliza itakuwaje unaona ya kwamba nitatoboa kweli Mr. Shedi Emma Jemeni thank you asanteni sana because uh, the words that you spoke to me leo hii tunafurahia kuwa hapa and uh, journey hii ambayo tunaikamilisha eh, mwanzangu amesema sio mwisho wa kusoma kwa hiyo tutaendelea vivyo hivyo najua tu wengi sana wanapitia changamoto kama hizo eh, ususan kwa kina dada na hata wanaume eh, kwamba labda familia kidogo wazazi eh, hawajiwezi vile lakini kwa kile kidogo ambacho wanachanga changa na wewe inabidi tunaishi katika nyakati ambazo sisi wenyewe ni watoto yani wanafunzi but you have to strive ni kama unajua mzazi kidogo amelemewa inabidi ujitume hata wewe kujisomesha wewe mwenyewe so it's a struggle but you know never give up ekeni mungu mbele na kila kitu kitakuwa shwari thank you so much kwa maombi by the way this is the first university ambayo nimeona ya kwamba wanashughulika sana na masuala ya uh, kiimani e, ni kiimani kila wakati tunapokumbusha kwamba tumtegemee Mwenyezi Mungu it might sound unajua vijana wa kisasa uh, mbona tuna wanatuambia mambo ya Mungu and all that but at the end of the day ukitafakari kweli bila Mungu hatuwezi kutoboa so thank you so much uh, and uh, St Paul's at large madam Anne tumekuwa naye mpaka nimemwalika kwenye kituo changu cha redio amekuwa uh, kishauri vijana kuhusiana na mental health issues and all that so everyone everyone you've been a parcel uh, in my journey and najua hata wanafunzi wengi sana tunaweza tukipeana hadithi zetu hapa tutataja kila mmoja kwamba alichangia kwa njia moja au nyingine katika masuala ya communication Mr Steve thank you so much uh, because pia <laughs> umekuwa umekuwa wa kutusupport wakati ambapo tuko na changamoto za masuala ya mawasiliano you are there for us thank you thank you thank you very much we are proud to be St Paulians na tutawakilisha hata huko nje tunapoenda kuwakilisha thank you